At the Amansky Law Firm, we believe everyone deserves a second chance. Hi, I'm Gary Schwartz. I'm an attorney with the Amansky Law Firm. And I know some of you are wondering what happens on a second DUI. Well, if it's a second DUI within five years, the judge has to give you 10 days. And he has to give you 10 days at the time of sentencing. He can't give you a turning date. When you get sentenced, you're going to be taken right into custody right then. Now, does that mean that's all the jail time that you're going to get? Not necessarily. Um, it depends on the facts of the case. If you ran into a house, you're probably looking at more jail time. If someone gets hurt, you're probably looking at more jail time. If you were driving like a total maniac, you're probably looking at more jail time. If there's a kid in the car, you could be looking at more jail time. Now, if it's a second DUI offense that's outside of five years, or it's been more than five, five years since your last conviction date, there's no mandatory jail time. But again, it depends on the facts of the case, whether or not the state's going to be seeking jail time. Now, in a case like that, sometimes you may be able to approach the judge and see if the judge will avoid um, forcing you to do jail time if the state's being unreasonable. But those are strategy decisions and that you really need to uh, utilize the services of a competent DUI attorney to help you work your way through the briar patch of a second DUI.